thank you for clicking on this video. My name is Ellen and I deliver in the Henderson Green Valley, Las Vegas area in Nevada. Um, if you are also any kind of a gig driver, whether it's delivery, ride share, or any kind of gig work, uh, subscribe to my channel. Um, maybe watch a couple of my videos. Excuse me. I'm not gonna ask you to like until you've finished the video. And if you feel so inclined, give it a like. So I think I wanna try this strategy. I was watching uh, Pedro's last video um, and something about like, you make more money an hour if you don't have that many apps open. I think that's what I got. I kind of listen as I do other things um, with these with these gig tubers, and I, I I hope you do the same with me. I, I mean, or however you want to watch it. But anyways, uh, besides the point. Uh, but basically, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna try every hour, uh, just log on to one. I mean, this is me hypothetically thinking, but I'm gonna try logging into just one app. Okay, got my first order of Shake Shack. How? For how? How? How for Uber Eats? Okay, but here we go. We've got this. Took a. I did it. I um, screen shot. This is China Ogogo. It's not the best. One mile, five dollars. But hey, we'll take it. Let's go. Now I am doing my hour shift with DoorDash. I uh, uh, logged uh, logged off of Uber Eats about five minutes ago. Um, I declined a DoorDash order; it was too far. Um, and then I accepted this one. I I didn't do a screenshot, but I I when I as the order was coming in, but I did it after. So you'll see it's eight fifty.
might be going a little over my hour. Um, I stayed on to Grub uh, DoorDash and then I signed on to Grubhub, but nothing came of Grubhub, but I did get an order for DoorDash. Uh, it's not the best, $5.75, and I think it was only like two miles. So anyways, I was here, I was already at Jamba Joe, so I'm like, you know what, I'm here to make some money. My Grubhub hour starts now, it is 3.07, I just accepted my first order. Uh, it's Jack in the Box, three miles, no, I think it was like two miles, $11, so, so far, so far that's almost exactly what I made and uh, Uber Eats. Yes, what game do you need here? So that definitely was a fun pickup. Uh, there was two um, uh, more mature women, um, I would say around the 70 age, and they were just a lot of fun. They were so cute. Uh, one of them was asking the other one uh, if she wanted a job at Jack in the Box. And anyway, so they had a lot to say, and they were really funny. Um, and it, I, obviously I'm not going to record them because that will in, invade their privacy, but, uh, I, if I did, I would have gotten a ton of play. Okay. So hopefully this, it said it was ready, but I think they just see it a lot. Anyways. Jeff, or Jeff? Oh, there it is. Thank you. Oh, and this is Patrick. <laughs> that one just came through. It's going to be made for you really quick. Okay, thank you. My hour on Grubhub is done, and I made 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, a little more than $17. So definitely the hour on Grubhub was better than DoorDash and better than Uber Eats. So, so I paused my um, apps to do a little, uh, a little sh uh, gift shopping. So I did that. Um, it is now about 4.45, so as you can see, it is getting darker, but I'll still stay on. I'll probably still record some stuff, um, but I'll just have to stop if I'm going to record myself and turn these lights on. So um, I'm going to go ahead and log on to all three apps. Um, I might, I kind of like doing the one app an hour. Um, I don't think I'll make as much. But um, especially at night when it's dark, it's a little nerve wracking when you've got all three apps on and they all three come at once and you're trying to like decide which one's like the best to take. So sometimes it's a little bit on the, especially if you're driving. So like, anyways, um, I will log on to the apps and I will take you along with me once I get it. So let's go. Okay, let's get the order for uh, the DoorDash customer. It took me a bit to find it, but we're here. Getting the Hi. Picking up for Alexa for DoorDash.
Thank you. All right, so this is a Grubhub order. Um, Eight dollars, four miles. Uh, I don't know if the order will be ready. Um, I know with Uber Eats and DoorDash, usually they're just on the counter, but I've never picked up a Grubhub from Panera before. So we're gonna see how that goes. And um, maybe, maybe later today I'll get ice cream. Sundays. Okay, let's go get the order. Fingers crossed it's ready. So I am picking up a Panda Express order for Uber Eats. It's three dollars. No, it's three miles, eight dollars. But then I get a message from the customer that said, um, "Please make sure it's the right order." What did it say? My son's something. Please make sure it's the right order. I've had the wrong order dropped off. You've gotten wrong. He's gotten the wrong order. He's gotten the wrong order. So. Um, I want to cancel it uh, just because I feel like since it's Uber Eats, if something is forgotten, he will t take the tip at, um, so, but I'm not, I'm going to see what happens and hopefully he doesn't take the tip away, but anyways, we'll go back and see. So let's get the order. Well, uh, I definitely stopped a lot of my deliveries to do some, uh, holiday shopping. So I did that, um, but it's 9.30. I'll probably go out and maybe get a few more orders, but I just wanted to end my video here. It is a little bit late, obviously, um, but I hope you guys have a wonderful night, and I um, will see you next week. Uh, like, share, subscribe. I'm trying to bring my channel up a little bit, so if you could do that, I'd appreciate it. Have a great night. Bye.